I think that's a question you need to ask yourself. Oh, Simon's dead already. Okay, hello everyone! Welcome to Castlevania. Just during the demo, uh, Simon Belmont died already, so that's a sign of what's to come. Yeah, I'm leaving that in. So, um, as we said this multiple times in, uh, oh god, in, uh, Lion King, Blake, we had, we do a roulette of games that we're going to play, and these were one of them, and Blake chose to do Lion King because he knew if I was to play, um, if if he if he were to play Castlevania, he'd want to finish it. it. And even if I were to play Castlevania and I were to give up on it, he would still want to take over and finish it. So yeah, because I've never played a Castlevania game, and I've heard a lot about it. I've heard they're hard, so that's why. I mean, I knew I was gonna have the choice between that and The Lion King. They're both hard, hard. So I was like, I'll pick the one that you know where I'm not gonna be required to beat the whole game. Oh God. He just got attacked by a panther. I think that's a yeah. <laughs> a steel panther. I think that was supposed to be a dog. Yeah, yeah, it definitely looked like a panther. Which of uh, you know what I actually love? What? Is the fact being that uh, uh, people would think hearts would mean. Uh, health, but it's actually not its chicken. So what are the hearts for? I don't know. They're for giving to your crush because she'll fall in love with you. And by that I mean she'll reject you. And then you'll be sad. You got a thing. You got holy water. Ah. Uh. I'm guessing that's what that is. Yes. So, to some, since I was not born in the, oh, that thing, it, it kills all of them. So to let people know, yes, I'm gonna suck because I nev was never grown up with the, uh, the NES. I was grown up with the uh, PlayStation 2 era. Oh, what do you know? There we go, chicken. See, I grew up with an NES. I wasn't born during that time. I was born in 97, but I grew up with an NES, but I only had Super Mario Bros. and Duck Hunt. We never bought any more games. So, yeah, I would suck at this too, even though I am... Even though I did grow up with an NES. Oh no, the Frogmen. Those look like uh, Mario Art Kings from Fallout. From Fallout 4, specifically. <coughs> <laughs> nope! Oh, uh, kind of like the creature from the Black Lagoon. I think, which might be what the Mario Art Kings are modeled after. I I think so, yeah. Because, well, then again, oh, there went that money. Well, it's real nice how they just drop things right off the edge. That's super cool of them. Wow. You're like, hey, Simon. How you doing, bud? Oh, I died. <laughs> I don't know. I think if you collect enough hearts, I think like a hundred, I think you get... Um, you, you, unlock, you unlock donkey mode? No, I, 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 I think you uh, get more life, I want to say. Oh, fuck off. Whip it. Whip it good. Whip it real good. That's na, a, na, 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 that's a na, na, That is a completely different song. Na, 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 na. <laughs> You're thinking of Push It by Salt and Peppa. I was, I was doing Whip It by Devo, which is a much better song, in my opinion. Although I don't dislike Push It. Fuck. Well, this is going to be an in Good thing if we play this towards Halloween. I don't know. 
We might actually, because I already, like, said we're going to probably take... Run. <laughs> hey, God. Nice. I don't know if I actually said this. So, yeah. We might take a break from some games. So, which off this one would be 100%. Oh, God. This, this will be, like, 100%. Going to be that way, not because I'm fuck. Because again, as I said, I'm really not good with the NES since I was not born in that era. Do Do you not have like lives in this game? Huh? Do you have lives in this game? I don't know. I don't see a life counter, and you've already died multiple times, and it hasn't given you a game over. Maybe they're a, a little bit merciful. Like we're going to make this game hard, but you have infinite lives. Uh, oh my god. Well, it seems like you have less hearts than you had before. Maybe if you run out of hearts and you die, you get a game over. I think that might be it, yeah. I think that's why you have to collect hearts. Yeah, like it just takes like 10 hearts or something like that when you die. Get that one. <clears throat> Simon Belmont, you're going to be in Smash one day. And I'm not going to play as you ever. I don't think this is Simon Belmont. Yeah, I don't know if it's Simon either. No, it, it, it's it's Trevor Belmont. Well, there's another Belmont smash. Is, that, is it him? Yes. You're so, right? yes, if you're all wondering, yes, this is Trevor Belmont. And, yes, even though I don't play... I never played this game... I know that for a fact because I've seen people who have played this game before said that is his, in fact his name. It is in fact Trevor Belmont. Okay, well then. Oh, well shit, I'm down here too. Sorry, where can I get you? Oh! More spooky and spooky. Oh no! No! Me gone, you hags! We gone. Oh, I thought it was E.T., but he's purple. Damn. And he's wearing a robe. Gotta be honest with you, E.T. Uh huh. That movie makes no sense. Oh come on! What kid would find an alien living in his shed and just be like, "Hey, I'm gonna become friends with this guy." Golbat just fucked you up. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Thanks, Golbat. Yep, now nah, I died. <coughs> so, uh, if you stick with us, I am gonna get kinda... I will grind, and I will get good at this. Hey, hell, maybe at the end I might actually get good with some NES games. So, you're playing this on the, uh... The like NES classic, right? Yes, because so, I. Can you can you save it on this? I believe it automatically saves for you. Okay, good. Because I'm gonna say if, if we have to restart this game every play session, that's gonna be annoying. Yeah, it it, it saves you off where you. God fucking. Oh well. Okay. Because, uh, yeah, it, it it saves where you last left off or where you last played, so it doesn't technically... I forgot to jump. Well then. But, yeah, I... We technically do have an NES with us. It's just that we don't have the actual NES game. But, uh... Yeah, we have my NES. You and your big game collection, you don't have a freaking NES. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> I've been trying to get it. I mean, I got some good actual rare consoles. Like the 32X, I have... The PlayStation 2, the PlayStation 3, the PlayStation 2 again. Fine, okay. I own literally... 
I'll go by a list from what I actually own. I own a PSP, I own a freaking 2DS, a 3DS, a 3DS XL. The most, I, the most pointless console Nintendo's ever made. Yeah. Then I own... What else do I own? I, I own a Dreamcast. I own... I own a lot of the Sega products. I own the Genesis Model 1 and then 2. Then I own... But do you have the Pro Games Player? The what? The Pro Games Player. Um... No. Well, good, because that sucks. Uh, that that's the the thing from that John Tron video, the plug and play consoles. The one that had all the original games on it, but they were all terrible. I've actually tried to find that online, but I can't find it. Yeah, there's some consoles that's actually gonna be like very rare to actually kind of get and yeah, find. Yeah, see, that was just a shitty plug and play, but it's apparent it's, it's apparently super rare because I could not find it anywhere. But he did say in the video that. He thinks he's found a console that no one's ever seen, so... So he pretty much... Oh my god! Fuck prayer. you, you fucking bat! Oh, excuse me, that bat did nothing to you. Except that he did. Yeah, he did a shitload to me. Um, let's see, what else? I own the PlayStation 1, 2, 3, 4, and 4 Pro. Yes, I own a lot of PlayStation consoles. But not the not the PS5. I noticed. I'm gonna work on that. Maybe here soon. How do you use your item? Like that. Oh. You just hit forward and then at the same time when you're. Let's go that again. Ah, my fucking. He's the fucker. Ow. Ow. Well, that actually works really well against him. You got him. Um... Damn. Woo. Hurry for Simon Belmont. He did it. <laughs> You're just gonna keep on calling him Simon Belmont. <laughs> yep. Okay, well. Um. Yeah, so basically. And then I own a 360. I don't own the. I sadly don't own the original. I have some Game Gear games. I have. I have a lot of shit. Is all you guys need to know. Enough to where we can play some very games to. Amuse us, but uh, yeah. Sadly, some of the classic NES games I don't technically own. Um, which off I wish I did because some of the repos are like fucking fabulous. Like Noah's Ark. Noah's Ark? Yes. Do you have a Super Famicom? I fucking wish, damn it! I mean... There's so many crazy bootleg games you can get for that thing. I know, I just listed them off. I just listed one off. Oh, Noah's Ark is a bootleg game? Yeah. It was... Oh my god, it was a horrible thing. The, the only, uh, the only, no, like, Noah's Ark related game I know is, uh, the, the, uh, the, zoo, the Great Zoo Race, or just the Zoo Race, or something like that. Mm -hmm. It's another one that John Tron talked about, but a lot of YouTubers have played it, like Markiplier played it. Um, but yeah, it's a, uh, 
a game where animals race, and it's uh, it's got like a lot of like religious stuff in it, like related to like Noah's Ark. But uh, yeah, they literally call it like the the Great Zoo Race or whatever, and then uh, Noah's Adventure Two is like what it's the full title is, and. There's no game that's Noah's Adventure 1, so... Yeah... That leads people to assume that it's a sequel to the Bible story, so... Well, it was kind of like... How do I say this? It was kind of like a cash-out, if that makes sense. Because after the NES public domain got... After the NES got a little bit more out and they went to the Super NES, a lot of people were trying to, like, pirate it stuff... Because Sony, out of all the consoles, Sony knew how to actually prevent it. But after some time... Oh, come the fuck on. I wasn't even on there. Well, that's it, actually, on this episode. What a great way to stop right there. It's about to get hit hey. in the face with a Medusa head. Hey, baby. I want to make out. Come on, give me that kiss. Man, that, that's I love your floating head. I love your snake tentacle, whatever the hell that is. I love you, baby. Give me a kiss. I'm a dude. Oh, well then. It still, still, still applies. Yeah, still applies. <laughs> Simon Belmont, everybody. <laughs>